this, I'm immortal. When I feel like this, I'm immortal. When I feel like this, I'm immortal. Hey everybody, and welcome back for another episode of Wildflowers. Ah, uh, let's see. Let's check on this. Do I have anything going? Can I make... I think I needed more lemon, didn't I? No, I need all of the oil. Uh, Snickle Fritz. Let's see. I already made that. Um, yeah, I didn't do that before we went to bed. I just... No. In her barn. Now that we have the lock picking incantation, I probably need to make a few more of those, don't I? Oh, I'm out of sugar. Er, sugar. Uh, magic. What's wrong with me? I run out of sugar. so hot. That's okay. I swear I'm crazy. I am crazy. I've got a disgusting, awful headache today, y'all. It's just catastrophic level. And dizzy. Hopefully won't have a seizure. I don't know. I can't promise nothing with today. Just, oh, it's so bad. It is so bad. I bought water, so hopefully I don't have to. Um, where's my water? Um, anyways, see, I have, um, a brain tumor, but it's actually, like, an invisible brain tumor. Um, they, they can't find it. They don't know where it's at, so they can't remove it. <clears throat> um, but it causes a lot of pressure in my head and causes like neuropathy, stuttering, seizures. Um, there's no way to remove it because like I said, they can't find it. Um, it's just bad. <laughs> but it, it's actually, it's called pseudo tumor because it's like a ghost tumor. And, but my body's responding just like I have a tumor. I mean, Medically, there's no difference than what I have versus having an actual tumor, except with an actual actual tumor, they can take it out, you know, and and try to fight it. Juliet asked me to teach her some of my Nana's dishes. It's awful. <laughs> I was so excited. I rushed over to Lena's to get what I need before she changes her mind. It's awful sometimes. This place feels so small, but whenever we go off island, I feel small. It would probably help you to go to bed earlier at night instead of walking through the woods at nine o'clock. Anyways, um, yeah, it's just, uh, I've had migraines my whole life. And I thought it was just, you know, stress. I smoked cigarettes and stuff, so. I was like, ah, sinuses. Just giving off a hundred million reasons why I had such debilitating headaches. And, um... Then I started, uh... Having seizures and stuff. And I was like, okay, well... Maybe there's something going on. <laughs> and so I went, uh... To, I actually went to the sinus doctor 
and he did um, a CAT scan and said that I needed sinus surgery, which was freaking awful, y'all. I don't know. It was awful. Anyways, he gave me the sinus surgery and uh, called me back like, I don't know, two weeks later. He said, I was looking back over your stuff. He said, and I think you have what's called Chiari malformation. And I was like, what? He's like, it's where your brain sticks out of the back of your skull. It goes too far down and it's pushing on your spinal cord. He's like, basically your brain's too big for your skull. <laughs> oh God. It's <laughs> strange living alone yeah. again. I suppose I'll get used to it in time. I'm too sad. Oh, we've my already heard that. Um, so I'm like, what do I do? <laughs> and he said, uh, he said, there's specialists that you can talk to and see. He was like, I'm gonna uh, put you in. He touch. went to the nursing home in Milkwater where Grandpa lives. He kind of perked up when Emmy and me started talking about all the fun we had at the summer festival. I wonder what it was like when he was our age. Mm. Um, anyways, he said, I'll put you in touch with my neurologist. And I was like, okay. So, um, I met up with this neurologist and she, oh my God, y'all, she's amazing. She's just talking to me. She did, you know, all kinds of tests and all this stuff. And she's like, I'm not going to tell you anything until I have made a full diagnosis on you. She was like, so you're going to come appointment after appointment. You're going to get scan after scan, test after test. She's like, and I'm not telling you anything until we're completely sure what's going on. And I was like, okay, deal. <laughs> she got done, I guess, and called me to come back in for a consultation. She said, and make sure you have someone with you, driving you. You don't need to drive. And I was like, well, I don't have a headache. She said, no, you need to have somebody with you. Y'all, I'm like, oh my God, I'm dying. And she's going to tell me I'm dying. <laughs> um, but no, it was, she did. She seen it and it was real. And I had it. It was scary. Oh, hi, Tara. What's wrong? We had to close our stand. Mom says there's not enough water to spare for our lemonade. Ugh, it's so hot. I actually can't wait for school to start. Things are getting pretty bad. Better help the coven turn the season as soon as Um, yeah, it, I don't know. She had heard of it, but she didn't have any patience with it. And this is a neurologist that had been in the practice for like years and years, you know. And she'd heard of it and all this other stuff. So she was like, I'm going to put you in touch with someone else who knows it better. Y'all, I'm freaking the frick out, you know. I had never I heard of this I became a teacher crap. because I believe that children are our future. Oh, so do you have any kids? No, no way. I mean, <laughs> not yet. Shush. All right, let's check on Lena, Lena, Lena. Uh, Don't forget to stop by Parker's shop if you need anything for your farm. He can build you a chicken coop or a barn. Look at her face. <laughs> um, yeah, so... I don't know, y'all. It was, uh... It was a scary diagnosis. It's not cancer. There's no tumor, so... That they can find anyway, so that it's not cancer. You gotta come out before miracle, sunrise, my know? dude. Dawn patrol. But it's still debilitating. It's the end of your life almost, as far as social interactions and stuff. It's pretty bad. What am I doing buying stuff? Stop. <sighs> How's it going so far on the farm? Let me know when you get some chickens. I got chickens, creepy. 
But, um, yeah. So she set me up with someone else. The other woman, she kind of confirmed everything. Sent me right back to Laquita. And, uh, I stayed with her. How's the farm been doing, Tara? Um. It's um, honestly been great. I think I'm finally coming into my own as a farmer. Ugh, I'd expect nothing less from you. A strong work ethic runs in your blood. But, um, see, the Chiari malformation is basically your brain. Like he said, your brain is too big for your skull. Um, but you're born like that, and that's why they termed it malformation. It's like they considered it in the beginning like a deformity. Malcontents keep you from reaching the pinnacle, but spending too much energy on finding malcontents also keeps you from reaching the pinnacle. It's a contradiction. I've been thinking about it so much, I have a headache. Jeez, don't hurt yourself. But, um... You know, now that it's more common or it's becoming, it's coming to light more often is what it is. Um, there's more people researching it and it's not a deformity. It's just your skull is too small for your brain. So that in itself can cause the pressure, the, the, which they diagnosed me with the pseudo tumor cerebra. Um, they said that the Chiari itself, you know, is being caused. Yeah, it might be being caused by the pseudo tumor. Whatever's going on in there, pushing, making not enough room. I don't, I don't know. My parents it's always pushed awful. for me to be the best in everything. It's hard not to feel inadequate, but I'd rather stay happy. Amen, sister. Or whatever. You, I'm, I'm not sure what all these titles. But, um, yeah. Uh, so that's why I have so many headaches and I have so many bad days. I mean, don't get me wrong. I have some freaking amazing days and I rock the days that I feel good. But the days that I don't, you know, they're getting where they're more and more often. And see, it got to the point where I was on 17 pills a day. And then they start talking about kidney failure and <laughs> all this other stuff. And I'm like, look, there's nothing that you can do. You can't help me at all with any of this. So... Why would I just, uh, you know, let you destroy my kidneys with your pills? So I, uh, come off all my pills. Probably shouldn't have done that, but I did. I said screw it. <laughs> come off all my pills. Stopped going to the doctor. I am 100% disabled now. Um, I can't really drive because, you know, the fear of seizures and all that while I'm driving. Plus, sometimes my head hurts so bad I, I can't even see. I'll get what is called aura migraines where you, you can only see like half of whatever you're looking at and it's all like a prism. Um... So yeah, I'm not allowed really to drive either, so. I swear, yeah. Sebastian grows an inch every day. I'm constantly letting out his trouser legs to keep up. Uh, can't buy anything, can I? I gotta sell outfits. Ooh, I wish I could make some. I got some stuff going though, the leather. But yeah, that's, that's a... That's what's up with me, and I don't want to be, like, just freaking whining about it on here, so. It may affect my life, but it don't control What is it, it like living in all that open space? To tell you the truth, it is a lot of work. 
Well, what a great way to work off delicious baked goods. Francis, hello, my dear. I had, um, I used to be a beautician before all this, and, um, I had a friend, Ken. He was gay, and I loved him so much. He was like my best friend, and I miss him incredibly. We didn't stay in touch. I've moved away. I'm just gone. This my island life is so like quiet that at is night. Gone. Where my cousins live, they have these little coqui frogs that make <sighs> noises all night long. They're cute, so much, but loud, though. like Angus when he's snoring. He always made me laugh. Always. Even when I felt bad, and I felt bad a lot. I didn't know what was going on. I didn't know. He always made me feel good. I've been experimenting with more metal-worked art. Oh, I wish I had the space for a proper sculpture garden. I wish I had the money. I'm going to have to do some of that, um... What is it? Fish sticks? Do I have any flour? Mm, I don't see any. Yeah, I probably used it all up. Alright, first though, let's go turn in the... I got my broom and everything. Let's go turn this in. Um, oh, I'm so sorry, little chickens. I've got no food for you. I don't think so. I've got one. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh. Okay, well, you don't get a hug <laughs> or love. I got no food. Alright, I'm gonna have to just. Oh my gosh. Because they're gonna hate me. Please don't hate me, little chickens. I'm a slacker. I will buy so much freaking food. <laughs> okay, run away. Don't even, don't even look back. Uh, yeah, I don't want to become a cat Come right here. now. I should have bought that freaking food. I should have bought a crap ton of it. I won't make that mistake again. Make my poor little chickens go without food. This is not what I'm supposed to be. <laughs> Anyways, yes, it controlled, took over my life. Don't go around overfishing. It's easy to get carried away and take more than you need to. But, um, I'm adjusting to it better now. I mean, it still hurts so bad. I can't even explain. But I, I know now better what it is. And kind of my limitations. Can I get to work on the wild broom yet? Oh, please say yes, please. It's your lucky day, Zephyr. I have everything you asked for. Woo! Ha! Time to do some crafting. You're really into this, huh? I just love my work is all. Now come back tomorrow and I'll have your new ride ready. Nice. You mentioned you have nephews. Sure do. M my sister and her family live in the city. Moved there years ago. I didn't know goblins lived in the city. Oh my, yes. Goblins love a good abandoned subway station. Ooh, nice and dank. Awesome. But, um, so yeah, that's my story. Um, living with it every day. Just trying to get through it. Um, Wesley, have you ever heard of any other place that has to change you know, their seasons? Not exactly. But in one of Shakespeare's plays, the Queen of the Fae has a speech about the seasons changing when they shouldn't. And the cause? Too much Fae magic. Funny. I'm 
gonna have to make money, y'all. But, um, I just wanted you guys to know just a little short, brief of why I'm always like, oh, my head hurts, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> That's why. Can't do anything about it. Um, I'm gonna leave that alone up there for right now. Let's. Do I have mm, speed up time? Okay. Now let's get you. Let's go check this. I don't think I I don't know why I didn't last time hmm. I don't know there is no room in this freaking thing huh <laughs> oh my gosh oh frickle sticks in my mind. Okay, so... Oh. So I have... Okay, I gotcha. Alright, so if I wanted to make an outfit, it would be that one. We need blue cloth, red cloth, and yellow silk. Right. With those cloth? Okay. Blue cloth, red cloth, and yellow silk. Stay on target here. I need one red. Oh. Shit hockey. Okay, well, I guess we'll just come back. We'll come back to that. Uh. Alright, y'all know what I'm gonna do, don't you? I'll be right back with some money. Okay, well that didn't work because Bruno can't sell me any fish right now because of the drought. So, screwed. Um, but, they said the cat is one heck of a fisherman. <laughs> And I haven't transformed in it at my own convenience, so let's do it. You that swim, run, or fly, please let me travel in your mind's eye. Okay, so let's oh, let's figure out. Whoa! Oh my! And it said the time goes a little bit slower too, so. Look at how freaking fast this cat is fishing. Y'all, anytime I need fish, I am transforming into this cat. Can I gather? Oh my gosh. Is there any fish over here? You chop wood? No. <laughs> but I just see the cat chopping wood. It doesn't seem like the time's going by slower though, really. Freaking amazing. Alrighty then. I'll take that. I'll eat that squirrel, huh? <laughs> I would never. I love little squirrels. Uh, that is so freaking cool.
in there. So throughout this whole time, I'm not going to be able to buy any bait or anything because of the drought. So I'm going to have to transform into the cat to do any fishing. So that's good to know. See, I thought the time goes a lot slower when you're in cat form, but it doesn't seem to be going a whole lot slower. It seems faster, actually. But that's okay. We'll just spend the rest of this time just kind of fishing until night. And, uh, get some stuff for when we... Ooh, too sorry. Oh, um, that's probably because of the other one. Um, get some stuff that we can cook that with. Hi, guys. I'm a cat. I wonder if the cat can cook. <laughs> Wish the cat could make some freaking animal food. That's so traumatic not to be able to feed your animal. Alright. Any fish up here now? Nope. I'm just making rounds, just fishing, y'all. Enjoying this fast fishing. Nothing over there yet. Was there fishing up the hill? I don't think so. Am I digging that? No. Nothing over here. I think there was fishing up here too. Yeah. And an almond. What a dice! Right in your face! Let's have a dice! Oh, my head. Alright, I gotta figure out how to get out of Kitty Cat. Because I might as well use up my energy. Kitty cat. Oh, we shall see. Well, what do you know? Did I do anything now? No. <laughs> hmm. <Wow. gasps> Ooh, but I can fish. Colin cave fish that lives in underground streams. Nice. Mm. so awful, aren't I? Doing it again. 
Is that hacks and cheats too? Oh, well, I guess I'm just a hack and cheat kind of person. I can't help it. If it's there and you're able to do it, why not do it? I don't understand. How is... I don't think it's cheating. A hole. <gasps> mushroom. Mushroom, mushroom. Y'all are gonna be so like, ah, you know, she keep doing this. Cause I can. Rado scoping. I wonder if that's worth a lot. Like a few thousand million coins each. I know it's not. I'm just playing. A pup fish. I didn't know I had already caught one of those. Alright, let's go in and make some of this up. Um, did I already do? Am I doing leather? I can't do anything as a freaking cat. <laughs> I can't cook either. Oh no. How do you uncat? I can't go down there. Yeah, I had to um, <laughs> mute my mic. And all kinds of good stuff. <laughs> and then I realized almost 10 minutes later, my mic was muted. So I'm doing a voiceover now. <laughs> um, yeah, so... We're running as the cat. Um, I figured out that I can't fish off of there because it took me a minute. And I'm like, why can't I do that? Blah, blah, blah. It's because the freaking cat's little paws can't reach down there. Common sense, duh. And I just run around the beach kind of like looking for a fishing spots. I uh, can't believe I muted the mic and forgot to unmute it. I'm telling y'all. telling you. My head is just... Bleh. I get done with this one. <laughs> I am not going to try to record another today. I'm just going to kick back and watch some Walking Dead for a while. Ugh. Make me some hot tea. Uh, still looking for fishing spots. I see Marty and I'm like, oh, I couldn't buy food from you. And here you are on the beach. My animal's starving. <laughs> and just walking and fishing. I love how the cat fishes like that. Oh my gosh. That is so nice. I don't know if I say it with the mic muted or not, but I decide I'm going to have to spend one day fishing as the cat, like the entire day. And then I'm like, I'm just a cat. I'm just a cat. Don't be scared of me. I'm just a cat. <laughs> uh, I'm a moron. Oh, and it's 8 o'clock. And I've already figured out I can't do squat as a freaking cat, so I can't even complete the coven thing. And the only way to get rid of cat form was to go to sleep. So I'm like, ugh, I got all this energy. Can I do anything with it? And so we fish. Then I'm going to run back up there. Oh no. Oh, actually. Oh wait. Yeah. <laughs> See how undecided I am? Oh my gosh. And then I like screw the energy. I don't care. I'm just going to go to bed. 
I'm gonna wake up in terraform. Should I go to sleep? <laughs> I will wake up in my human form. And I still have it muted because <laughs> I'm still a moron. Yeah. <sighs> Yep. And then I read this. Barn in stable condition. Task complete. You have been rewarded with a barn. And then Hayfield can now be built from Parker's services. And then I go over here and I'm like, oh, what can I make? Can I make anything? Let me just spend a long time looking at this. Uh, hmm. There we go. I can make some of this. Five. Uh, minnows, sure. Three. Stuffish, sure. Three. And one pupfish. And that's all the flour. But I made some fish fingers. I keep calling them fish sticks. What do I have down here? Uh, nothing. Uh, hold on. I got magic. Oh, screw it. Alright. What about over here? And then I'm so excited because I'm like, ooh, yeah, let me do a blue. Uh, okay. And then I'm like, ugh. I grab that. And I'm like, can I do another? No, I don't have the tanning solution. So I'm like, crap. And then I'm like, ooh, yeah, a wine is done. Can I make another? Oh, no, it's my last grape. Oh, well, wine. Um, and I looked around here and then I was like, Wait, silk. I could use I could use my thread to make one silk. Then I'm like, oh, but I really, really, really want that outfit. Hmm. Nah. <laughs> if I can wait. Uh yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have the leaf for that. I'm like, ooh, look, I can make that. <gasps> nice. That's so pretty. Sandstorm long. So I can make another. What else can I make? But I don't have the thread and stuff. Yep. I want that is what I want. The wild berry shorts outfit. I need a yellow thread. And I'm going to... I'm thinking, should I go ahead and make the yellow thread before I use it up accidentally? So, I don't know. Give us another soil. Now I know to make that hayfield or whatever, it takes a lot of soil and I don't think we have a lot. I don't think we have a lot at all. And I got a water. Ugh. I love how the water hardly moves, so it's not like taking up a lot of it just from watering. I ain't planting no more crops. As soon as those are done, each one, I'm going to uh, change the seasons. Oh, and I was trying to run down the other way, but I'm a moron and went that way. So I want to go buy food for my animals. I got to feed my little baby animals. And then I'm like, hmm, let me put on the outfit. 
Shazzy. I love that outfit. I think it's so pretty. Then I come over here and I'm like, oh, look at our barn. It is so pretty. Let me attempt to get a cute angle for a screenshot. So now, how about inside the barn? Then I turn around and I'm like, ah, oh, this is a cute one. Don't I wish I'd stayed in cat form for the mice? They could take a picture with the cat. That would have been great. But I ain't wasting a uh, spell on that. So then I'm like, okay, I've got to feed my baby. Stay on target. This whole freaking entire time with a mic that was muted. Yes, I did it again. I'm going to have to do a voiceover for that whole freaking time. Oh, I hate my head. <laughs> I would gladly swap heads with anybody. The soil's been whispering stories to me lately. I used to think I was losing my mind, but I've done this long enough to know all farmers learn to hear its voice. Nice. The only voice I'm hearing is the one saying, you dumbo, why didn't you turn your freaking mic back on? Are you an idiot or what? And then I'm like, yeah, I am. Oh my gosh, he's not open. Oh, he, he opens at night. <gasps> And feed my babies. I got one. Oh, oh no! Run, <laughs> y'all! It's a hard knock life. I'm telling you, it's a hard knock life. This is why <laughs> I am 100% disabled. I cannot function out in public. There is no freaking job. Oh my god, it's Sunday. Get in your store. There is no job that would have me. I'm just gonna have to sell some of this food I'd already made. Oh wait, I do sell it to her. Sweet baby Jeebus, help me. I'm telling y'all, I'm telling you right now. I cannot function in society. <laughs> oh, God. Sorry, Lena. I just spazzed. Oh. This is the worst. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. I don't know where I paused it at or for whatever reason. I don't know. I find it back on recording, uh, on the recording of it when I'm doing my editing. So I know y'all keep screaming at this screen like, oh no, don't forget this, don't forget that. I'm gonna forget. <laughs> I'm gonna forget what we're supposed to be doing every time. And yeah, I'm only buying 80 of it right now because I'm gonna tell you right now. I am going to get my broom. And I think one of these days it probably gonna be Wednesday I'm gonna take off no matter what quest needs turned in what's going on I'm taking Wednesday and I am going to be out of touch because I'm gonna do nothing but farm for money <sighs> that's it and that's all I'm gonna sell fish catch fish buy fish make fish whatever I'm going to do everything that I can do. And I'm going to get so much money, it's not even funny. How my freaking broom's ready? <gasps> it is! <laughs> Alright, Tara! Get a load of this! My finest work yet! 
I don't want to say that it looks the same, <laughs> but it looks the same. It's thinking. how she flies that matters, not how she looks, silly. <laughs> and she'll only fly for you. Now, you'll only want to use this broom in Fairhaven. Perry placed a charm here to keep witches from coming and going unannounced. Oh, and you can forget about taking your broom into the glo- Oops, I oh, said too much. Oh, Lucifer. Uh, never mind, never mind. The glow? What's the glow? Nothing, nothing at all. Anyway, uh, oh, here's some levitation potion. You'll, uh, need to keep her fully charged to fly around, so, uh, keep a batch of levitation potion brewing whenever you can. The little people see me on my breath. more goblins to teleport into the mines while I'm there, but I've only seen you do it. Well, uh, that's because I'm the only goblin left in Ravenwood Hollow. Oh. oh that's sad. I'm not gonna win Wesley's heart by not talking to him. <laughs> Is it weird being born human and becoming a fey later? No. Oh. Tara, you have no idea. I'm still getting used to it. Oh, just like you're still getting used to being a witch, I'm sure. You got that right. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not gonna spend any money. I'm gonna keep the money I have right now. Just... So I can maybe, hopefully, um, you know, get my animals fed and buy the things I need to. I'm gonna sell that outfit if she still wants it. Poor babies. I'm so sorry, mommy didn't feed you. It's a bad mommy. It's a bad mommy. Pretty. Fly by. I had a butterfly fly by. Flutter by. <laughs> Alrighty then. Um. Ugh, it's already eleven o'clock, and I'm just off kilter so bad. I haven't even spoke to Thomas. I didn't get to make my rounds. I already spoke to Thomas. I'm telling y'all right now, the struggle is real. It is so hard for me to focus on stuff when my head feels like this. Normally I have like episodes saved up and stuff and I've used them all up I've felt so bad lately Enchanted broomstick is handy for zipping around town. Requires levitation potion to fly. Don't worry, non-magical civilians can't see you when you're on your broom. Okay, so what do I do? Oh, M. Oh, wow. I don't want to do that, though. So it's not like you can just hop on it and fly around. That's... It's like teleporting is all... A Francis on the beach. Sometimes I think I should have put my shot by the shore so I could look at the ocean. Then I Yeah. yeah I said that. <sighs> hey, 
anybody up there? Nope. Okay, well... Ugh. It's Sunday, so mostly everybody was closed. Mom says there isn't enough water to make lemonade. Things are getting pretty... Yep, just your mouth. Did I already buy from you? I think I did. Dr. Yeah. Syed can hang, brah. She totally fixed my shoulder uh, and my ankle and my wrist. But like, those are all completely different times. Uh, yeah, I don't need to buy any. It's good to know I can and don't have to wait. Is there any other get rich quick schemes? Alright, let's see. Juliet see used to play another. her songs for me first. Now I'll catch her playing music I've never heard when she's around town. No one warns you how hard it is when your kid grows up. Oh, I know. Alright, so let's see. A coffee, you buy it for 40, you sell it for 20. Nope. There is nothing to make money here. Mm -mm. Well, that's okay. I once sent my mom a selfie during service. She saw Messenger Cameron and asked if he was my boyfriend. Mm. I think she's holding out hope that I'll bring someone home to meet the family. Finn's decided he wants to knit Lena's dad a pair of socks. Now, he could use a project, and I'm sure Marcus would love them, but I'm just not keen on introducing Finn to pointy objects right now. That is too funny. All right, so everybody's done, I think, with Creepy Cameron. I don't want to talk to any of them, <laughs> truth be told. All righty then. Um, Shelby's over here in the woods. In the woods. Yeah, I'm gonna ignore him, Ara. Uh, just don't feel like chit chatting with everybody today. <laughs> Hair is in a in a mood. Who decided the waking world was the real one? We spend half our lives in the world our of lives. dreams. Should be O U R. Definitely gonna be coming back here tonight. Um, let's get some chopping done. Yes! And it is close to an hour right now. So what I might do is uh let me see, was there anything that's tonight? I can't really do that right now. Okay, so what I'll probably do is just spend the rest of the daytime kind of uh, just gathering and waiting around till night. And um, I'll bring you guys back for that. Okay, I brought you back early. <laughs> now stop. Because I wanted to show you. Oh my gosh. And I just ruined it because I chopped it once. I'm an idiot. 
the trees when they get big like this you can walk up to them with a tap and you can tap them but because I'm a complete and utter moron I can't do that I got another one growing here though I'm a moron maybe it'll come back or I'll chop it okay well yeah I'll bring you back later sorry I'm a moron Alrighty, we are back, and it is seven. I'm going to collect my moon flowers. And this is what we're going to turn in at the break-in point. Let's go do it. Tara? Busy writing at your desk, I hope? You bet. We're ready to go. <laughs> Woohoo! Meet me by town hall between 8 and 11 tonight. Time for some light breaking and entering. Sneak into town hall after dark. You got it, dude. My familiar started clawing at our back door and then prancing over to the couch like it's his. Sebastian's like, why is this cat so chill with you? And I'm like, uh, who knows? Cats, dude. We have to meet at night to keep the coven secret from the townsfolk, but make sure you get your sleep. Tired witches just brew up trouble, and not the good kind. Okay. I asked Amir to come with me to Perry's shop to pick out the right herbs I need for an incantation, and she was like, no. What's that about? We do have our broom. Let me show y'all. So you click on the broom and then you can click pretty much anywhere you want, like right here. And then you have to click on this one more time. You can't just actually fly the broom around. It just basically teleports. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's almost time. Oh. This is going to be a long one to edit. Because some moron forgot how to unmute her mic. Yeah, that's me. Yep. Yep. All right. So tomorrow will be Monday. Lena's will be open, but Bruno and Sophia will not. So I can't do my food trick tomorrow, but I can buy a crap ton of flour. Um, well, I thought she said be here. Uh, buy a crap ton of flour and then fish all day. She said at 8 o'clock, I thought. Didn't she? She said. Maybe on Monday. I don't remember what she said to me. Well, it wasn't here, was it? Maybe she meant, maybe, maybe she meant somewhere else.
Oh, I need to put some flowers on here anyways. Let's do witch weed. How oh, pretty. When I found out Lena was High Priestess, I wasn't really surprised. Some part of me always knew. But did she know the truth about me? Even when we were kids? So nothing here. Maybe it needs to be another night. Time for some light breaking and entering. Sneak into town hall after dark. So do I just do it myself? Do I go in? No. Town hall, you dippity doodah. Telling y'all. It's my head. It's my head. <laughs> I blame it. Phew, you came. I was afraid you might chicken out. Hey, I don't back out on my word. And I'll never doubt that again. Come on, speak the incantation to the door and it should open right up. Here comes the moment of truth. Steal the keystone. To retrieve a magic rock. First, this locked door must unlock. Ooh, we are smooth. Let's not celebrate just yet. We still have the display case. Yes, here it is. To retrieve a magic rock, first this locked case must unlock. Oh, no. <gasps> not again! Run! Oh my god. Oh. You run fast! Cause I'm so full of adrenaline. I'm a Look few seconds thighs. away from finally going Look to the stones. Hold up. Right now? You know tonight, she runs fast. obviously. No one can hold me back. At least let me come with you. I can't. What if it's dangerous? That's exactly why you should let me come. No one is going anywhere. What were you two thinking? Breaking into town hall? I didn't know an alarm would go off. Even if it didn't, you know how dangerous the gloaming is. That place? It changed my dad forever. And it took my mom. I need to find out what happened, Lena. I... I understand that. But no one goes into the gloaming alone. Not since, you know. Violet, I promise we'll talk this all over at the circle tomorrow. But for now, give me the keystone and go home. You were really going to go in by yourself? I didn't want you to get hurt. I'm sorry, Tara. Hmm. Just when I figured I ferreted out all the surprises around here. Breaking point. That's complete. Alright. Oh no, we're not ready for that. No, no, no. No, no, no. Alright, let's go. Um, actually, let's go home. That's not my home. Where's my, where's my home? Let's go home. We're gonna need more of the, um, I almost said floating lotion. Ah, <sighs> levitation, whatever that, whatever. Can I make it? Oh. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Let's put it on. <gasps> Look how cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, alright. Alright, we're going in. We're going to bed because we got to. Alright, y'all. Am I ready for bed? Yes. Hate to waste the energy. Look how cute she looks. Oh, our cotton scent and mulberry too. Sweet. <sighs> okay, and I'm going to call this one right here. Like I said, 
I'm not going to do any quests right now, but I feel like stuff's going to be triggered because we did that. So, on the next episode, we'll go through all the repercussions of breaking in. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave me a like. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. And I will see you all on the next one. Bye!